Hello YouTube! So, I've been doing like major rebranding just because this is the start of my channel, the start of my account, trying to figure out like my name, my branding with my profile picture. So, I'm gonna show you. I started with these sketches. This is like my profile picture, but I kind of want to change the eyes a little bit. So, these are some different versions I came up with. The three that I really like the most. So I posted these on my Instagram and my Snapchat. A lot of people, this is one, two, and three. A lot of people said one. I think I like both, but for my main account, I think I'm gonna go with the masculine one. And then we're, oh, <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> we're gonna be painting shoes. So I already cleaned these. I don't even know if I took a picture of them. I should have. I wore these in Miami and I got these shits busted. I got these so dirty. But I cleaned them, I creased them. I should probably look up a YouTube video how to get this out because this is like, this is weird. These are my Reeboks, I love these. I'm gonna paint my logo like right here. The only thing I don't like about Reeboks is that the canvas space is so small because of the Reebok um, symbol. We're gonna see what we can do. So I think I'm gonna put it like right, or it'll be right here. That's kind of sweet too. Depends. I might just do just the logo or I might draw some other doodles to go with it so like it looks complete because it might look a little empty if I just put the logo right here. We're gonna see. We're gonna take you along for the process. I'm sorry I didn't take you for the shoe cleaning. Maybe we'll have more shoe cleaning in the pro in the future if you think that's satisfying. Sh dirty shoe revamp. And I ain't talking about Playboy Cardi. Okay. Let's go. I'm going to be painting this version of the cat on the Reebok. Okay, so before we begin, I almost began without doing this. Um, I read some uh, articles online and the shoes come with like a protective ceiling already to them. So, we're going to take some pure acetone. I got this from the beauty supply when I used to do my nails. Now I don't anymore because it's like, it takes me triple the time to do them myself. And it just, they come out ugly. So I just don't do them at all. So, we're going to take this acetone and clean this, clean the area we're going to be painting. Okay, it feels like I'm ruining the shoe. Hold on, guys. Um, it feels like the paint of the actual shoe is like... Oh, it's making it look wrinkly. Or did it always look like that? Or maybe I'm hallucinating. I don't know. We're just gonna go with this process. We're gonna be painting over it anyways, but I don't want it to be wrinkly. It's fine. Okay, so for supplies, um, I just bought this brush from Michaels. Uh, this is a one. Okay, it's one. That's the thickness of it. It's uh one of those liner, the liner brushes. So you can get the nice lines. I never had one of these before. I just see them on TikTok and YouTube and stuff. So we have that. I got some Q-tips just in case I make a mistake so I can hurry up and like dip it in water and wipe the paint off. Hoping I'm not going to have to use it. But we have that. We're using just acrylic paint that I have. Just regular acrylic. And we use the acetone. I don't know if you should be doing that. My shoes looks fine. It just looks a little wrinkly. Hey everyone, it's voiceover Danny, and here I go. I just do a layer of black acrylic paint, and I just start painting my logo. I just go in for it. I did not sketch it at all. Um, honestly, while I was doing it, I thought maybe that could have been a mistake, but it wasn't. It, but I'm not going to spoil anything for you, okay? So here I go. And there's me with the white paint marker, because pro hack life tip. If you take the white paint marker and go over the edges of your shoe it will make them a lot they will it will make them look a lot cleaner and here i am just doing the details 
Then I just repeat everything all over again on the other shoe. And fun fact, my logo's name, the cat, his name is Puncho, if anyone wanted to know. So here I just do the same design again on the other shoe, outlining his eyeballs, and voila. Okay. Uh, I look crazy, I know, but it's fine. I just finished my shoes. It's my logo. Yup. They do look, the cats kind of look kind of a little different. The eyes shape is different on both, but I like both eye shapes. All what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna get the acetone again and I'm gonna do the backs and I'm gonna do like uh, X Idalian because make it look like it's a collab, but it's like my version of a collab, even though Reebok never said that we were actually collabing but we're one can only dream it'll happen one day not today off camera i painted x Adalian on the back and here's just me lacing the shoes back up i had to look up a picture to make sure i laced them upright and this is the final product yup 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 thank you for watching i hope i inspired you like and subscribe to see more videos by me and have a beautiful, blessed day.